Hello everyone. In this video, you'll learn how to displaying data and chart control from the database in Windows Forms application. As we know charts and graphs make data easier to understand and interpret. First, right click the database and choose new database. Enter the name of the database and click the OK button. View the newly created database from the object explorer. Now, create a new table. Right click the database sample and choose new table. Add a few data to the SQL table. Open Visual Studio. I am using Visual Studio 2022 and create a new Windows Forms application. Drop a chart control from the toolbox present in the data tab. We can also change the chart type as well as appearance from the series collection editor. Change the name of series. Here, I set the name to profit. Bring the system.data.sql client namespace into scope so that you don't have to fully qualify the names of its members. SQL connection class represents a database connection. This code creates a SQL connection object by passing a SQL server connection string. gets or sets the member of the chart data source used to data bind to the x value of the series. Gets or sets member columns of the chart data source used to bind data to the y values of the series. Within any given chart, the inner plot position is the rectangular area, inside the x and y axis lines, where the data points are drawn. The plot position is the rectangular area that encompasses the inner plot position, the tick marks, and the axis labels. 
The chart area is the rectangular area that encompasses the plot position, the tick marks, the axis labels and the axis titles on the chart. A chart area is represented by a chart area class. Chart area objects are stored in the chart area collection class. The number of chart series that can be plotted in a chart area is unlimited. Chart area back color property gets or sets the background color of a chart area object. You can change the chart series color as you wish. And click OK.